The world has gone crazy. Satanic panic is acting up all over again by your children because the devil is about to come. Ladies and gentlemen, no matter friends, welcome me. How are you guys doing? My name is Pete, but you guys can call me Pete. I was supposed to record this video last week, but I was sick as hell. Hmm? See what I did there? Hell. <laughs> Because the satanic panic is happening. So we are all aware of the Gujira uh, opening of the Olympics. That was amazing. We got a whole week of the Olympics happen already. But the satanic panic still rolls on. A bunch of people thought that the opening had like satanic meanings and that that means at the end of times, that means that Satan is coming. I don't know. We're gonna go through a bunch of like statements that people made, including an answer from Joe Dupontier, probably butchering the name here, which is the lead singer of Gojira. Very important disclaimer before you guys watch this video. I don't have anything against any religion or any beliefs. If any religion turns you into a better person in this world and makes you do good things, I am supporting you in, in having that religion. But some stupidity, which is not for of the religion, has to be pointed out. And let's go. Was the Olympic opening a ceremony satanic? So this whole thing started on Twitter, including his non-Elon Musk account uh, sharing. Do you think the opening ceremony of the Olympics was satanic? Yes or no? So this charge was further amplified by Andrew Tate. <laughs> I cannot not laugh by seeing this. So this is adding a lot of seasoning to the whole thing already. Tate wrote, Satanists control the West and they show you that they worship the devil. It's not a conspiracy theory. They literally show you. Are you blind? The particular segment was also set to the heavy metal music by French band Gojira. Unbelievably, that is just the beginning of the burning pile of evidence that suggests Satan spent several months planning the opening ceremony. Can you guys imagine that? Satan just, just planning the Olympics. What do you plan, Lord Satan? We shall open the gates of hell. Rise up to the earth. Women rose from the water. In a tableau sold to us as being about the famous French value of equality and in recognition of the Olympics, achieving something resembling gender equality. Golden statues of women rose from the scene. You know who else rose from the water according to Botticelli? Venus. The pagan goddess is the namesake for the planet Venus, which is also known as the Morning Star, aka Lucifer. Women have also been proven, via persecution, hysterical femuring, and scapegoating, to be witches, and witches were sometimes said to have communion with the devil. We got more signs that it was satanic. Mr. Dog, the dog father, was not technically part of the opening ceremony. What does Snoop do when he's not creep walking with the Olympic torch and cheering on? On athletes from the sidelines, his smoke spot, we, Ganja, Mary Jane, the Devil's Letters. They are literally worshipping a golden calf in the Olympics opening ceremony. Do you still not see it? People were going crazy. Look at that, look at that. It's literally the devil. 3X uses reporters seeing a golden bull in the opening ceremony. There are unconfirmed reports that it was Moloch, a pagan god or demon most commonly associated with child sacrifice. Next one. French Catholic Church, the last supper parody at the Olympics was an insult to Christianity. The ceremony unfortunately included scenes in which Christianity was mocked and ridiculed, which we deeply regret. The portion of the ceremony featuring 17 drag artists evoking the famous Da Vinci the Last Supper, which it wasn't quite like that. Our historian Louise Marshall has said that there were 17 drag artists and that for that tableau to be a reference to the Last Supper, you need 12, that's basic. You kind of have to have the number. We even got Brazil going on, even we even got Brazil. Brazil coming in hot, also joining. The opening of drags is satanic, it's a blasphemy. God, uh, Paris was in a blackout because it was the wrath of God. And now she's explaining why it doesn't make sense because like 17 people, that's just the same what we're just seeing here. But even Brazil joined there. The satanic pick, it's worldwide. Got more here. The opening ceremony of the Olympics is not even hiding the satanic rituals anymore. There is no longer anything hidden in plain sight. These are the demonic dark forces of Satan who want to eclipse the light. You can already see skulls, motifs of death. 
Satanic red lightning. Children trapped in tunnels. Did anyone notice that a single rider on a pale horse is straight out of the book of Revelation? We got, we got Riley. Riley here saying, I feel, I feel heartbroken for the Olympic athletes, many of which are friends who train their entire lives to compete on that stage, but will now have significantly fewer eyes watching and admire because of the satanic, blasphemous display put on by the Olympics organizers. So you got a concern season here as well. Dear Normies, you were probably sat at home watching the French Olympics thinking, what the f actual fuck is this? Well, it's just another conspiracy playing out in front of our very eyes. The one where we tell you the world is run by satanic globalists who control everything. These people do very strange, sick things and openly worship Satan or a brand of. The Satan has a brand? What is it? What is Satan brand? It must have some sick merch, bro. Got Neilan here with, with, with some wise words. What sports did I just watch? I had to check if it really is the Olympics opening ceremony. As a Muslim, I feel offended for the Christians. <laughs> a whole religion openly mocked and no outrage. What sort of disgusting satanic circus is this? Need to bleach my eyes. I love how, it's, how people, people are taking like other people pain, you know? And there were a lot of people as well saying that the Gojira band is satanic. And therefore, the song that they were singing was satanic as well. And, you know, a lot of people were not understanding why Gojira was there. They were like, why we have, like, metal, you know? But here's a good explanation about that song. I thought it was very curious and I, I thought it was very, very nice to bring you here. So we got Librarian of Burgos explaining what is that song, which is a very good explanation, by the way. For those of you who don't know, the song that Gojira sang at the opening of the Olympics is a French revolutionary song from the 1790s called Asai Ha. Satanic! Now, it's said that the expression Asai Ha was popularized in France by Benjamin Franklin, who when asked about how the American war <clears throat> against the British was going, he would answer in sort of like broken French, Asai Ha, Asai Ha, and that means it'll be fine, it's going, it, it'll be fine. And the song that Gajira sang, the version of the song that Gajira sang, I think it was the more kind of violent version of the song because Asaiha had several versions and um, Gajira, I think, sang the saint -Culotte version. The saint were the mass, the urban masses of Paris who were very pro-revolution. Um, <clears throat> and the song goes, and the, the more violent version of the song goes, uh, Asaiha, 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 Les aristocrates à la lanterne, asaïha, asaïha, asaïha. This is les clearly satanic. And so this means, it'll be fine, it'll be fine, it'll be fine. We will string aristocrats from lanterns. It'll be fine. The aristocrats will hang them. Um, and this is a great revolutionary song. I love how they, uh, how they mentioned here that is like the more, vi the more violent one, which it was a choice and it, it, it matches with Gojira, you know, it matches with the sound, with how heavy the sound is. And then we got the metalheads, which I, I just love. I just love when, when the metalheads start to speak out, speak out loud. Aaron here, Aaron is waiting. Gojira getting accused of doing satanic rituals. Metal is so bad. I completely agree. It's, it's so bad. It's so metal. It's just the start of metal all over again. Gav, the miracle, from the miracle of sound, pretty, pretty, pretty important figure there. The satanic pen itself is so 1983. The silver head in the French Revolution, the band Gojira makes really awesome songs about nature cleaning up garbage, saving the whales, protecting forests, etc. Calm the fuck down. Yeah, I'm, I, I hate to bring it to you, but whales are actually satan animals. Crustacean fella, people whining about how Gojira playing the Olympics is satanic, as if their entire discography isn't just about trees and nature and shit. <laughs> and then we got Gojira's Joe Duplenty responding to the accusation. Satanic, not even close. It's none of that. It's French history. It's French charm. You know, beheaded people, red wine and blood all over the place. It's romantic. It's normal. There is nothing satanic. France is a country that made a separation between the state and religion during the revolution. And it's something very important, very dear to the foundation of Republican France. We call it laïcité. It's when the state is not religious anymore. So therefore, it's free in terms of expression and symbolism. It's all about history and facts. 
And here you have more info about The Last Supper. The ceremony art director, Thomas Jolly, assured everyone this scene has no connection to Christianity. There is Dionysius, who ar arrived on this table. He's there because he's the god of celebration in Greek mythology, Jolly said on the French news channel BFM TV Sunday. The idea was to have a pagan celebration connected to the gods of Olympus. you never finding me a desire to mock and denigrate anyone. So there it is. There is the Satanic Panic of 2024 happening here before our eyes, guys. Before our very eyes, people are just trying to distort everything. And just because they don't understand what metal is and they don't understand uh, French history, they just think that it's Satanic. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys found it very entertaining. And, and now I hope you guys are aware that... Satanic is I invite you guys to subscribe to the channel if you guys like this video. Subscribe to the other channels as well. We got music reactions on the other channel and we got a gaming channel as well. And if you guys enjoyed my vibe, twitch.tv slash creepy from Monday to Friday, 6 p.m. GMT, alright? Last but not least, don't forget to drink your coffee and catch your light everywhere.